from the desk at Old Mates. You're watching Backyard Tech. Okay, now this sort of goes without saying, but when it comes to pasta dishes, the world looks to Italy. And let's face it, the Italians know what they're doing with pasta. But at the same time, it's very easy to make them upset. And for one man, well, he's practically left the whole of Italy weeping. It's bizarre news time here at the Backyard Tech Channel. This one, a man's carbonara monstrosity is so bad, the Italians are left weeping. From Backyard Tech, this is Bizarre News. G'day everyone, thank you for tuning in. It is Bizarre News time here at the Backyard Tech Channel to kick off Thursdays and, oh, wait, just put it this way, wait till you see this picture. Now, I like a carbonara, a traditional carbonara, okay? Um, a very, very close family friend of ours was an Italian chef and that's all I'm going to say. He is... Pasta dishes were phenomenal, and I don't like pasta, but a carbonara, yeah, I do. Wait till you see this, though. Let's get into this one. A man's, uh, sorry, start that again. This is from The Mirror over in the UK. I apologize. There are so many ads on this page now. It's very hard to find the story, but anyway. Man's carbonara monstrosity is so bad, Italians are left weeping. Stephen S. shared a picture of his carbonara to the Facebook group, Rate My Plate, and people are saying it looks so bad, he's obviously given up on life. Find the mouse. There we go. A man's carbonara attempt has been called the quote-unquote worst thing foodies have ever seen. Stephen S. shared a picture of his carbonara to the Facebook group Rate My Plate, and people didn't hold back. Rate My Plate. Now, hang on. I'm not going to show you the whole thing yet. I'm going to read this first, and then you can see it. So, Rate My Plate is a community where people share pictures of their weird and wonderful creations, which most of the time are completely slated by these harsh amateur food critics. Stephen's Carbonara, which looks nothing like a traditional dish, is the latest dish to be cr critiqued. According to one group member, quote, carbonara is generally comprised of pancetta, eggs, yolks, heavy cream, garlic, and plenty, plenty of freshly ground black pepper, which is right, generally speaking. Okay, brace yourself. Okay, Joe, brace yourself. Because if you are a food person like myself, this is probably not just going to leave the Italians weeping, you're going to feel sick. Need I say anything else? Look... <laughs> You know what it looks like? He's got a can of Heinz spaghetti, a slice of, you know, square cheese, and chopped up chopped up some um, whatever that is. That's his carbonara. You can pause that if you want. Quote, a hard Italian cheese is also added during the cooking process with sharp uh, Pecorino Romano being the first choice, but salty and mellower Parmesan filling is, ne is in whenever necessary. Stephen, how Stevens, however, is very different and it's made up of tinned spaghetti, a slice of American style cheese, and chopped up frankfurter. One person said, quote, this is literally the least effort you could do, you could go to, oh, start that again. One person said, quote, this is literally 
the least effort you could go to to make yourself a meal. You have obviously given up on life. Another added, uh, quote unquote, sorry. Another added quote. Now that, my friend, is one of the worst things I've ever seen on this page. I wonder what you had to drink with it. A nice glass of vinegar? That's a bit like wine, isn't it? Close quote. A third said, quote, that is many things, disgusting, scraping the bottom of the fridge, cupboards, lacking in culinary skill to name but a few. It is, however, most definitely not a carbonara. In fact, I'm not even convinced it's food. Please consider cooking lessons when lockdown ends, close quote. Yeah, I'd agree with that. And, quote, in what world is that a carbonara? Italians everywhere are weeping over this monstrosity, close quote, said a fourth. Stephen's post has received nearly 4,000 likes and 7,800 7, comments from foodies who couldn't hold back their disgust. Um, just to make your fir Thursday feel a little, uh, a little uneasy, would you have a look at... I'm not sure you could even give him points for trying. Seriously. If I've got any Italians watching this channel, unfortunately, I would whilst I would love to hear you go right off your collective, you know what, due to obviously I've got to be careful of my channel, I'd hazard a guess and say that is far from a carbonara and I'm not even a foodie. But that is just... N need I say any more? That? It look, you know what it looks like he's done? He's, it looks like he's got a can of tin spaghetti, a piece of whatever that is, American cheese, and then it looks like he's got skinless hot dogs because they don't even look cooked. How's everyone's guts feeling after looking at that? Well, you can't even give him points for trying. As we say here, time will tell, but not in this case. That, oh dear. Um, if you do want to leave a comment, those that know the rules here at Backyard Tech, feel free to leave a comment, you know the rules. For those that want to fly off the hammer, unfortunately, I can't publish your comment. So if you want your comment published about that, you better adhere to the comment rules. But that is just, yeah, okay. I'm, yeah, we'll leave it at that, guys. We'll, we'll catch you in the next video. I'm not sure if saying cheers is uh, the right thing to say, but uh, we'll leave it at that. See ya. This has been another presentation from Backyard Tech.